Hi, this is Robert with Trolling in Paradise. I'm back with uh, an impromptu video. This is going to be a tribute to Leonard Skinner guitarist Gary Rossington. Unfortunately, Rossington has passed away today, March 5th, at the age of 71. He, around this time, was the last original member of Leonard Skinner, as all the other members of the original lineup are no longer with us. Uh, Rossington was the only member to do every album with Leonard Skinner. And yeah, uh, he was one of the founders of Leonard Skinner, along with Ronnie Van Zant, Billy Powell, and Bob Burns, as well as Ed King and Alan Collins and Leon Wilkson. And that was the original lineup for the first two albums, which was pronounced Leonard Skinner, which was going in 1973, and Second Helping in 1974, with the which had their big, most well-known song, Sweet Home Alabama, which they wrote as a response to Southern Man by Neil Young, which after Neil Young threw shade on that state. Because of a group of uh, people, men that were attacking him over his hair at the time. And yeah, R Rossington, he uh, has been through the ringer quite a bit. He uh, survived that plane crash in 1977 that took the lives of both Ronnie Van Zant and Steve Gaines, one of the guitar players. And. Rossington, along with Alan Collins, Artemis Powell, who was the second drummer, and Liam Wilkson, uh, they survived the crash, thankfully. That unfortunately took the lives of Roy Van Zandt and Alan Collins a few days after Street Survivors, which came out in 1977. And their debut album, Pronounced Leonard Skinner, had its 50th anniversary. I think it's this summer, I believe, is when... Uh, the anniversary, official anniversary is, uh, which has some of their most well-known songs, like Tuesday's Gone, Give Me Three Steps, S Simple Man, I love Simple Man, uh, and also Free Bird, an amazing song. And yeah, I've, I even got to see Leonard Skinner uh, twice with Johnny Van Zandt on vocals. Uh, this was uh, I saw them twice. First time was in Victoria at San Woods Memorial Center in 2015. And second time I saw them was in 2019 in Abbotsford with Rennie Bachman opening. That was an amazing show. And the last of the Streets of Virus tour, the last tour to have Gary Rossington before his passing, uh, unfortunately. And I knew it was going to be the last time I would see them. And there's a horrible, sad reason for this now. Sadly, we've now lost the last original member of Gary Ross of the band, Gary Rossington. Rossington did has has also had some health issues in recent years. He's had some he had some heart problems. He had heart surgery in uh, 2021. He had to have some stents put in, and uh, yeah, he has he had not been healthy in more recent years. So, Gary Rossington, born December 4th, 1951, leaves us today, March 5th, 2023, at the age of 71. Gone too soon, man. No one gone too soon. So, rest in peace, Gary Rossington! You will be missed.